freaking leaf. It's like flying and it's like staying in the sky and it's not falling because of the way the leaf is designed with it holes and surround it it's literally floating in the sky as if it's some kind of phantom or ghost or some kind of something i mean look at that it's crazy it's twirling it's never gonna fall it's gonna be staying in the sky probably for a long long time until the wind calms down and it's just gonna keep on going and flying until it's just not gonna work until it's staying until the wind stops oh my gosh look it's flying it's Oh, it just fell away! Oh, ha, ha. Oh, ha. Wow! That was crazy! Oh, poor leaf! It's okay. Let's see if we can take this leaf. Let it fly again. The wind got a little bit too crazy for it. No, it's not flying no more. The wind didn't like it. The wind didn't like it. It was defying the laws of gravity, and God was like, No! This leaf! shall not defy me. And now, see what happens? See what happens when you defy the laws of gravity? You get bitch slammed. Let's get it. Oh, poor leaf. All it wanted to do was to fly. And it was floating, and it really was. It was floating. It was doing everything a leaf has always wanted to do, and it was happy too. You could see it on its face. Oh, it leaves that basis. And then what happens next? A huge gust of wind comes and it is slack. Screw that! You ain't flying, son! No more. And what happened? The wind was so strong, it broke the leaf. It broke its spirit. And now it's just gone. It's the philosophy of flying. Sometimes you think you can be flying, and you're flying. Then you get too much. And then it ends up being that the thing that you thought you were loving, right? It ends up turning around on you. And the very thing that you wanted is a thing which destroys you. Because you get too much of it. Thank you, Luke. You have taught me something very much.